Hey guys, welcome back. We've got a brand new video for you guys today. I'm using my new camera to be able to like do this. It's really portable. It's really nice. And uh, there's my computer. Yes, my room is an absolute mess. I've been gutting out some of the corners and stuff like that. So, right here, you're wondering what this is. This is a shelf with a light. And you are right. But what's under the light is the star of the video. Our ant colony. So, as you can see here, I'm currently attempting to move them. Let me try and pull out the test tube a little bit. So, I'm moving them between two test tubes. I do not have a AC test tube portal. So, that is probably in specific why I'm using this, which is instead just a bunch of other stuff that plugs them together. The test tube setup that I'm trying to move them into is covered by light or darkness so that they want to move into it. And so that's great. And then use the actual colony. It's really blurry on this new camera, but that big old black dot is indeed the queen ant. This is a Laceous Niger colony. And so, hopefully when I move them into a better nest, besides a test tube, it will be easier for you guys to see them. But right now, they're just there. So I guess I'll make an update. I'll tell you guys if they move in. And my idea is to move them out of the test tube when they move in. So when they move in, I'll give them a while, regenerate their workers, get healthy and strong. And then I will move them into a test, or I'll attach it to a test tube portal with a little bit of tubing that will connect to an AC Laceous hybrid nest, which is pretty cool. I'll probably make a review about that when I actually move them into it and show you guys. But hopefully, if the queen is into the uh, hybrid nest, then it will be able to see, you guys will be able to see them, so, yeah, kind of small, but they're great, and so if you're wondering where the thing is, so I have a bright light above them, so that they want to, they get irritated, and then they want to move into the next SC, so, that's why I have the bright light so close to them, <sighs> let me just set it back for a second, so on the nest just above is indeed our... Ants Canada Glacius Hybrid Nest. Hold on. So, yeah, hold on. There, yeah, the shelf's falling. Oh, crap. That's no no. Oh, sorry. I pulled the shelf too far out. But it's pretty nice. It looks like that, kind of. And there's four different entrances they can go in, and then it's just a bunch of nesting space. And then up here is just some tubing that I've got so that they can crawl around through the tubes and pipes and stuff. So, I guess until I get my AC test tube portal, you will not be seeing these guys much. So, I'm just moving the bulb, not touching, but indeed very close to the test tube so that they want to move out. Alrighty, that's that's all I have to say for today's video. So go ahead and subscribe. One new shout out. We have a shout out to the best day ever. So that's great. If you do want to be in one of these shout out videos, all you have to do is go onto any video and any comment section and then just put in sh shout out in the comments. And then, yeah, you get featured in one of these videos. You get a shout out. So, yes, leave a like and subscribe. Go ahead and do the same to the best day ever. And see you guys around. So, yeah, goodbye. I'll make an update on these guys.